Hey guys, how you doing? Rahul here, and today I'm going to be showing you how you can simply change your dull, washed out coloured version of CSGO into something with more vibrance, just more oomph on the colours, and something that which just looks pleasing to the eye. So to actually get your game having all this vibrance and stuff and making it look really good, all you have to do is go to the link in the description, it'll take you to this website, and what you want to do is click download for desktop PC. It'll wait a little bit, and then you'll get your download right here. It'll be a WinRAR file, so you can just open it up and extract it. I normally extract things to my desktop as that it's the easiest place to find things but extract it to wherever you want it to be extracted to make sure though it's somewhere where you can easily get to and then once you open it up you'll be able to whoops you'll be able to open it up right here and open up the exe file it's completely fine it won't give you a virus or anything and also it's completely vac safe you won't get vacked if you're using it on matchmaking or face it or anything however the one thing i'm not 100 sure on using it on is esca now if you know for a fact it's okay to use an esca and you use it in esca then drop that in the comments so um you can that other people know but I personally don't play ESCA at all so I'm not 100% sure whether this is allowed or not but basically you get this little window right here really um, limited options however it's all you really need you can have it auto start which some people might want when they start their PC to have it auto start. I personally don't as I only start it when I'm playing the game. You can keep your vibrance on when CSGO is running so the vibrance level which you've got in game it'll run throughout when you're using windows and stuff but I don't like that. I like it so when I alt tab out my game it go goes back to normal. You can also change your in-game vibrance level which is the main thing to change. 140 is a nice one to start with. If you find it's too vibrant then you can drop it down. If you want some more vibrance then max it up a little bit and for your windows vibrance I wouldn't recommend changing this as the vibrance level you get on normal windows is completely fine and I don't think this needs any changing. So once we go on to Steam and we can actually click play on our CSGO, it will load up our game and once we're in game, we can see that the vibrance level has changed and it does make the game just pretty much more vibrant, there's not much else to say and um, it makes everything a little bit easier to see and stuff and I've noticed that in like some places where sometimes I found it hard to distinguish between players and walls and stuff, this has become a lot easier and I'm able to actually see where people are Sorry, and um, yeah it's just a lot more easier to play the game and it also a lot more enjoyable because I'm actually able to see where people are. So if you have enjoyed this video and you want to get it for yourself then as I said go and check it out link in the description and yeah other than that I've been Rahul hopefully you have enjoyed this video if you do have any problems at all with using this um, tool then please ask me in the comment section or if you've got any questions about it then ask me in the comment section I'll try and reply as quickly as I can normally definitely within 24 hours actually definitely within 24 hours I'll be replying so yeah if you've got any questions leave them in the comment section I've been Rahul catch you on the next one